Hello and welcome to this cryptocurrency technical analysis where I'm going to keep this one really short, concise, professional and sweet for you as we are going to be going through a new topic today. Of course, we're going to be diving into the Bitcoin chart. Of course, I'm going to be giving you some very important levels that you've got to be aware of right now. And I'm also going to be sharing with you a really nice way to trade Bitcoin right now. And that is with the correlation of the stock market. Yes, I know some people are going to be like, hey, I don't want to trade the stock market. I'm not interested. I just want to know about cryptocurrency and Bitcoin. I want to know how to trade that well. Well, in today's video, I'm going to show you why it's an absolute must to be looking at the stock market if you want to successfully trade Bitcoin. This is giving a massive heads up every single time. Every pivot that we're putting in is directly correlated to the stock market. I'm going to be sharing some of those insights for you today. So you just need to please, for your benefit, pay full attention. Block out the distractions. Give me your focus, your full focus for the next 15 or so minutes because you're going to learn something and I, I know I know I can help you in this video. I'm going to be sharing a lot of really great information with you. So give me your attention. Let's get into the charts. Let's get into what we love. And of course, we're going to start off here talking about Bitcoin and the current range that we remain within right now. Again, some people uh, might, be, might be thinking I'm going to be going over some of these things to brag or say, hey, look at me, look at this trade. No, please don't take anything that I take here as bragging. Yes, a lot of these trades have gone very well. I'm very proud of that. I'm not here to brag. I'm sh here to show you the power of the technical analysis and hopefully inspire you along with that. Okay, so I want to first of all pick up directly where we left, left off yesterday's video. And during yesterday's video, of course, I was talking about two key resistances, the VWAP, which then I added on a clip showing the short that I took off of that VWAP. Uh, we then obviously hit the take profit, and I'll explain a little bit more of that. And then we were looking at the daily open there around 21,500 as the next level of resistance to the upside. Of course, in these free public YouTube videos here for the education, I am giving you levels that I'm looking at, but of course, all those levels are given first within side of the group. Of course, these are paying members. They're here to learn. They're very dedicated. They deserve that. And very first thing that I done in the morning was telling my team about those two resistances. The VWAP zone, as you can see, this yellow line here is the VWAP, and then the daily open. So I've really cut, simply come in. I want you to fully understand here. I've done my technical analysis in the morning. I've then really simply done all the hard work and given to my team. These are the two levels of resistances of today that we can look to trade off of. Well, during the process of the day, we obviously come up and we hit that VWAP to the absolute dollar. So you can see here, this is our confluence of resistance. We actually come up and we hit that to the absolute dollar high. And why was that the dollar high? Well, I think I showed you this yesterday. Uh, I had a short position, 21, 241, which literally held the market there to the exact dollar. And it was quite a special trade because obviously I've been doing this Bitcoin trading challenge account, bit of fun for people to see how I'm going along with the trades. And that trade was uh, the exact dollar high entry short, which brought the account to over 100 Bitcoin. So it was like, hey, <laughs> I had to do it in style, right? I had to do that in champion style, an exact dollar short entry to bring the account to over 100 Bitcoin. That was a bit of fun. That was a bit of, that was a, that was very special. I'm not going to lie. Uh, that account now is sitting at over 105 Bitcoin. Yesterday was a very special day of trading as I'm going to talk you through. But really to, to make you fully understand this, you can see here how I have have the level of resistance marked out. I have the plan. We hit it to the exact dollar and we obviously got the pullback. Where did we get the pullback to? The last low that was made, which for me was obviously a take profit. We can see here how the levels are respected perfectly. From that take profit, we got another bounce to the upside. From that next bounce to the upside, we're actually making another new low here. You're going to see this on the next screenshot that I show you. Okay, this next screenshot, you can see we come down and we hit that low once more with another swing failure pattern. OK, so now we can see great demand coming in at this level of support. We also then have a range high. We have a mini range to be trading. And we know if we break this range high, what's the next level? The next level is going to be the daily open. So let's remember that level that I've been giving you. That was at round 21,508. OK, and now this is how it progressed. We actually came up. We hit the daily open absolutely perfectly. OK, what more can you want? <laughs> um, this is also obviously within the trading only channel. This is my coach only channel. You see, I'm coming in here. There's no distraction. There's no noise. People were requesting this. We implemented the feedback you wanted. And I gave you a coaches only read only channel for all the coaches. On top of that, there's the questions channel where you can come in and I'm answering every single question. Okay. Every single question you can have, I'm answering every single one. 
Okay, this is a bit of a bonus, very nice. Somebody asked me yesterday, what now, Daniel? We've just hit the daily open. You can see here the timestamps. Do your own fact checking, nothing here's hindsight. We hit the daily open, 17.07 UK time. I told my, I told, I replied to him, I have shorted the daily open. The guy replied, thank you, greatest of all time. So you can see here, I actually gave you both the highs off the VWAP and then the daily open. I told you those resistances many hours in advance. I then, on top of that, gave very full, easy to understand confirmations of my trades live in the time inside of the group. Of course, this is for the paying members. But I then confirmed I've shorted the daily open. CC pool making money together once again. Six Bitcoin profit yesterday. I'm pretty, pretty, um, you know, I'm pretty happy with that. OK, but you can see here how I've had the plan marked out. I know the levels that I'm waiting to trade. I see the reaction. I take the short. I'm even giving confirmation inside the group. This is exactly what I'm doing. OK, and obviously, well, I'm going to show you the reaction that we've had from there. OK, so we obviously then start to come down. I give a level. It gets a reaction. What more can you want? All you had to do was listen to me and follow along and you could have made some amazing gains once again. This is a regular pattern right now. You can see that daily open. We obviously came down. And we started to bounce down around that take profit once more. I actually confirmed to my team inside of the group that I'm actually going to stay remaining within this short trade till the stop loss or lower to the lower targets that I gave in the morning. OK, and so I've talked you through briefly here, Bitcoin. Of course, I'm going to talk you through what I'm looking for next, how we're looking for this to progress over the next 48 hours. But I want to first, as I mentioned, talk you through the stock market. Why? Because this is now, this is very important. Please understand, even if you don't want to trade the stock market, I would question why, <laughs> because it's extremely well respected technical analysis. I told this to my team on Sunday during the Champions live stream. If you are struggling with Bitcoin, if you are taking losses on Bitcoin, if this is choppy price action for you, if this is stopping you out a lot, if you are getting frustrated with trading Bitcoin right now, give the stock market a go. Please give the stock market a go. Why? Because the technical analysis is very well respected. It moves slower, so you have more time to think. You have more time to plan. It is, it's just a very, very, very technical traded asset. We can obviously refer to the ES as the ES, the mini futures, okay? Or we can refer to, you know, some of these stocks individually, such as Coinbase, Apple, NVIDIA, Tesla, Netflix, Twitter, et cetera, et cetera. I'm talking about the whole gem here. But I'm going to refer specifically to the ES, which is the, you know, the S&P 500 E-mini futures contract. And it's a very high volume contract. Um, and I want to show you the direct correlation. So what do I mean by direct correlation? What I mean is when Bitcoin moves up or when the stock market moves up, Bitcoin moves up. When the stock market moves down, Bitcoin moves down. When the stock market goes sideways, Bitcoin goes sideways. So if you can do your analysis on the ES, you're going to have a major advantage over the rest of the competition that's not following it because you're getting these these heads up of the next move that's going to occur on Bitcoin. OK, so again, I'm going to refer to another post that I made within the group yesterday. OK, and that was this one. OK, so you can see here again, a, a, a guy has asked a question saying, how is the ES looking? OK, Daniel, can I direct this to you, please? I told him at the moment the stock market, the ES is looking weak. I'm looking for the point of control I showed in the champions live stream. And you can see here, this is the point of control I'm referring to around 4120, 4124 being the daily. So this is the point of control on the daily. I'm remaining patient. I recognize the weakness. I believe the ES is going to drop heavily down into this level. And that's where I'm only interested in this. OK, I've very simply come in. I've replied. It's looking weak. We're looking for a drop, and this is the one and only level that I'm giving you. I actually gave that in the Champions live stream. Please look at this as the reaction. This is how it progressed. From that move down, continued weakness, continued weakness, continued weakness, we hit that point of control to the dollar. Dick, real perfectly. Come down, hits the point of control. You could enter here longs, stop loss below the low. Look at that. Pump up to take the highs. While this was coming down, Bitcoin continued weakness through the night. When the ES got this large move to the upside, guess what happened with Bitcoin? Bitcoin got this large move to the upside. Direct correlations. If you are aware of what's happening here, you can remain patient in Bitcoin. You would have known there was a high probability we're going to test the range low. You would have remained patient in your shorts overnight. You'd have seen the ES hitting support, and that would have alerted you that it's very likely Bitcoin is going to bounce as well. And of course, Bitcoin did bounce as well. Okay, so this is, I mean, this is just, 
Really, 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 really helpful. And that, honestly, that is one that I call exactly as predicted. Largest volume market in the world. And I'm out here giving you the plan and the levels days in advance. And they are respected perfectly. I mean, this was, this was really, really, really beautiful. So that was just a little bit of explaining to you correlations, how you can get directly correlated assets such as the stock market, and you can get inversely correlated assets such as the DXY, the dollar index, for example. So you've got correlations, you've got inverse correlations, and these are assisting greatly right now when trading Bitcoin. It's a very, very, very big gold mine. Again, this is just scratching on the surface. I will say if you want to learn more about that, of course, you've got everything over on the website. And actually today, I have a very special members only live stream like I done last Tuesday, this Tuesday as well. I'm going over a stock and Forex update where I'm going to go really in depth on the stock market and I'm going to be going over exactly what I'm looking for. This was the plan that I gave last week during that with a drop to the bottom of the trend line, rise to our resistance and then a drop. And we all know how that played out. We got the drop. We got the rise, we broke down from that channel and a very big drop ensured, yeah? So last week I gave this and that's how it finished. And well, this week, again, in a few hours time, I'm gonna go over live again on the stock market for a very special update. So if you are interested in that, of course you can come over to the website where you can learn about our trading, about our tactics. Uh, you can get access to these updates live in the time as they're happening. So we've got the education, we've got the trading updates, we've got the live streams. You can see right now, actually, there's a live stream going on with George. Locally so we've got the daily updates every single day. You can see he's already been live for one hour, 10 minutes, talking you through the charts, talking you through exactly the, what's happening with the order flow. Everything you need to know live in the time, he's talking you through it right now. And if you don't like the long version of an hour long, update well he's already done, given you the short version which is a quick five minute condensed version of the update so every single day you're getting a five minute live stream an hour long live stream today you're going to be having another live stream from me so there's just so much content you're getting live streams galore content galore on top of all the live streams you're also getting access to our thought processes live in the time as it's happening what we're looking for how it's playing out the positions we're taking I mean, right now, I can, I can honestly say this is, you, you're, you're getting treated very well indeed. You are getting stuff like this handed on an absolute silver platter. So if you want to take advantage of that, that's, of course, over at chartchampions.com. Oh, yeah, by the way, another bit of information. We now have added even more speedrun modules. So we now have even more up to the expert level on the speedrun modules. So these are the hour-long live streams or hour and a half, two-hour-long live streams condensed into this five-minute version. So you can come in here and refresh your brain very quickly, easily, get up to date, get the information, get that refresh you know, again, we're listening to the feedback, we're implementing feedback, we're making a lot of positive changes. And um, now I'm moving on to what we're looking at next then. So <clears throat> real simply, once again, we still have this larger range going on. If we can reclaim the middle of this channel, we can look back up to this high, up to that 22,150 range high. Okay, so essentially, we've got a smaller range here, that if we can break the range high, we'll look back up to 22,150. Currently, if we reject and we put in a partial rise, we'll be looking back down again towards 20,600 to 20,700. So again, this is very really simple trading, okay? Yesterday, I'm not gonna lie, it was a lot easier because you had untapped levels. Today, you don't have those untapped levels. So it adds a little dip, bit of degree of difficulty, yeah? I'm, I would also admit that today is a harder trading environment than yesterday, okay? So you might wanna be remaining a bit patient now and wait either for the breakout to the top of the channel or wait for another rotation down to the lows where you'd have the next opportunity down and around here, which for me, this is obviously a zone, but this is still our zone of opportunities down here and the larger zone of opportunity up here. Here you obviously have a sub level for very low term time frame traders trading this mini range that you have going on here. Okay, well, day traders, this is also acceptable. Low term time frame day traders, you know, you're not looking for swing trades here. Your swing trades opportunities are at the very outer edges. This is more for day traders. But as I've showed you, you can be making money on the day trades. No doubt about that. There's money to be made on this market even on the smaller term time frames, even on the day trades, okay? So if you are getting chopped out, you know, if you're getting stopped out before the move happens on the swings, give it a go on the day trading, give it a lower on the lower term time frames. you might find your success there. Or if you wanna give it a go on the stock market, which I personally think is just 
amazing right now, really, really, really well respected. You are sleeping. If you're not trading the stock market, you're sleeping on some am <clears throat> on some amazing setups. That's all I can say. You really are sleeping on it. Give it a go. There's got nothing. You've got nothing to lose by giving this a go. Again, if you want assistance on that, then I got a live stream coming up later today to really get you involved in the stock market. Open your eyes to the opportunities that sit there. And even if you just want to trade Bitcoin, knowing what's happening on the stock market, well, it's giving you a massive heads up each time on Bitcoin moves. So. <clears throat> I'm going to be dying off my throat right now. So I'm going to wrap this up. <clears throat> Excuse me. I'm so sorry about that. But I truly hope you've enjoyed this video. I hope I've talked you through um, how we were looking through this yesterday, how I came up with these levels, how they were respected very well indeed, and giving you the eye-opening look into why you need to be looking at the stock market, the correlations there, and then how we can be approaching this mini range and then the outer boundaries of that range. If you've enjoyed this video, hit that like button and I'll be sure to bring you more content coming your way very soon. If you want to see more from me urgently, you want those live updates in the time before everybody else, that's of course over in the group. You get access to that via chartchampions.com. I'm just going to say thank you ever so much once again. I truly hope you've learned something today. I've enjoyed sharing this with you and CC Paul, send their regards. Thank you ever so much. And of course, I'll say no financial advice in this video, just an entertainment educational video only, no financial advice. Thank you ever so much. I love you all so much. And I'll see you over on the website, everybody. Cheers and goodbye. Thank you.